All right, y'all enjoyed the last series of anime hot takes from Takashi. This one is just what anime do Japanese watch in 2024? Let's get it. 今見てるアニメはありますか？今見てるアニメは今あるでちゃん好きアニメ一つだけ教えてください。Oh. <laughs> this is funny. Like four seconds in, right? You got like so. This is like light mode. This is like light mode and dark mode. You know? Light mode, dark mode. You got the you got the gals, right? The tan gals, the super long nails. Then you got like the cute uwu, you know, um, the opposite of gothic Lolita. I don't know, the Norman Lolita. I don't fucking know. 今見てるアニメはありますか？今見てるアニメは今あるでちゃん好きアニメ一つだけ教えてください。一つだけ？はい。キモすぎ。Hey guys, how you doing? I'm Takashi from Japan. So today、Yo. I'm going to interview Japanese people. What anime do Japanese watch in 2024? Okay, let's get started. Let's get it. 今見てるアニメはありますか？今見てるアニメは呪術廻戦。Oh. えもう五条先生がもうかっこいいですね。Yeah, Gojo Satoru, right? The Lady Killer. All the ladies love this show because there's so many hot guys. Little to no girl fan service for whatever reason. There's Mimi, but aside from that, there is Total Sensei, I guess. But like. There's way more guy fan service than girl fan service in Gojo、uh, in Jujutsu Kaisen. Ne. Ja, it's one of the most favorite ones. One of the most favorite ones is probably Shingeki no Kyojin. You might think that she is a normie for saying this, but I think that these picks are pretty good. She enjoys Jujutsu Kaisen, which is hype, and Attack on Titan. I think is a fucking phenomenal written story. I actually still haven't seen the ending. I still haven't. The ending I haven't spoiled because like I heard a lot of people are upset by that shit. I dropped Attack on Titan a while ago, not because I don't like it, but because I was so busy with different anime reaction content. But I heard the ending was bad. But like still, I think the story of where I read up to and watched up to, it's fucking phenomenal. Shock! I got the first concept. Shingeki no Kyojin no ga Jujutsu Kaisen yo. Attack on Titan over Jujutsu Kaisen? Yeah, I I don't think that's a hot take. I think that Attack on Titan's writing is on a different level. Compared to Jujutsu Kaisen, doesn't mean that Jujutsu Kaisen needs to be a good written show. It's just that's not what Jujutsu Kaisen is, right? There is a plot, but it's not supposed to be an amazing writing. It's supposed to be just fucking hype. Attack on Titan has amazing writing and it's stupid hype. Yuri, in my opinion, is good. Um, so that, ne, so that's ne. Like, ah, the story is very deep. I think. Like, honestly, Jujutsu Kaisen is Gojo Sensei. Shut up, bitch. Just tell me you're horny for him. He just cool. Every lady just watching this shit. They just love Gojo Sensei. They were like, "Oh my god, Nanami Gojo! Oh my god, they're so hot." かっこいいから見てるんだよね。もう五条シップって感じです。私の中で。今見てるアニメ教えてください。実力史上。Based, based. This girl. Oh, and any time Classroom the Elite anime gets representation, I fucking love it. I fucking love this. 主義の教室めっちゃ面白い、yeah. なんか学園ものなんですけどネットフリックスのおすすめに出てきて見てるんですけど、mm. あとワンピースも一からアニメ見直しててやっともうあの新しい話の That's actually so much effort and dedication to restart One Piece from scratch not the manga the anime <laughs> from first episode to where we are that's crazy that's a crazy dedication ところまで追いつきました今までで一番好きなアニメ一つ教えてください。Haven't seen Black Butler, and fun fact, we're not such a fun fact. This Sebastian was the VTuber、uh, persona that I was trying to model my、uh, VTuber role into, just like a sexy butler type. I hear Black Butler is pretty good. Is it like I would like to check it out one of these days, but I don't think you guys are really the target audience for that kind of show. Eh, 寝る前もスタンプ購入してそのボイスメッセージ聞きながら。So do you know why I decided to go with Sebastian for the VTuber persona when I was applying for a corpo VTubing? Because of shit like this. Watch what she just said and fell asleep to his voice, right? Voice packs of sexy butlers, bro. ASMR content. Do you understand how much that shit sells? It's fucking stupid. That shit sells more than merch. That's how you get more money off of selling voice packs compared to getting all the super chat donos as a fucking corpo VTuber, man. <laughs> It's、uh, I don't think people outside the anime community or like Japan, like if you like, I don't think regular like people watching like I, I don't know like North American people if they heard this and they're like voice packs, the fuck is that? So it's these pre-recorded messages of really hot guys saying hot things like oh 
You've been a good girl. You worked so hard today. Wow, eight hour shift. Let me take that shoe off for you. Ooh, a little bit marinated. No, I don't. <laughs> They would never go that way. If they started to go that way, everything would fall apart. This was what I was trying to do. I was going to do like cringe, ironic, funny voice packs where it's just like I am playing into the sexy SMR, but the dialogue is so fucking unhinged, you know? <laughs> oh, Kitaro. I don't know this show. Is this a children's cartoon? Okay. Dragon Ball. Oh. Oh. She even has uh, Powerpuff Girls here, huh? Okay. Oh, I like Powerpuff Girls. Oh, okay. Oh, I like Powerpuff Girls. Oh, okay. I like Powerpuff Girls. Oh, I like Powerpuff Girls. I don't remember a character named Hajime. This must be a manga character. I don't think this really counts as a spoiler, just like future characters to look forward to. Hajime? I do not remember a character like this in the anime. I swear to god if this guy fucking spoils this shit. Come on. Yeah. Okay. Cool. For the people that's read Jujutsu Kaisen manga, is Hajime actually goaded? Is is it an actually like really interesting and cool character? Or is this guy off the off the rocks right now? He's a cool character? Nah? Yes? Um, yes? Hmm. Well, kinda controversial character, isn't he? Your fashion is inspired by manga? I thought this guy walked out of a fucking JoJo set, bro. He looks like he should be from fucking part five. With Giorno and shit. Ah. I don't I think Naruto is a perfectly fine anime. I think that Naruto pre-time skip is fucking peak fiction, man. Thank you, Vork, for the five months of subs, man. Thank you so much. I think that Naruto, like people shit on it obviously because it's just like Unga Bunga, you know, shonen. But I truly believe pre-time skip Naruto is like I think it still hold up. Like, if you compare that compared to, like, recent anime, I think it still holds up in quality. And people shit on Naruto. One of the most common talking points is it has too much filler. And while I might have bandwagoned on that talking point a long time ago because I didn't critically think and I was just hating on it for no reason, just like people that hate on fairy tale and SAO, someone actually, other, other person said that I read recently was, I actually appreciate that Naruto had um, fillers. Because of those fillers, the episodes where it mattered, the canon episodes, were really concise and hype. One Piece, for example, is suffering. I hear in the Dressrosa arc, right? The pacing got fucking ridiculous because they try to cover one to one, like each chapter. And it's what is it? You start One Piece, it goes money, wealth. It's like power, wealth, fame. I love to throw in One Piece. The One Piece is real. Opening fucking plays. We're already five minutes into the episode. Nothing happens. Then you get a fucking recap. Now we're like eight episodes. We're eight minutes in. Then we get like two minutes of real content and an intermission scene. Then you get five minutes of content and ending and that's it. And you're like, what the fuck just happened? What did I just watch? Nothing. Right? That's why as much as people hate filler... Filler allows long-running shonens to have really concise episodes and schedule it. So in that... With that mindset, I think that Naruto, even with its fillers, is superior. One Piece pre-time skip anime is fucking amazing. Post-time skip, it kind of goes down the shithole, right? Naruto post-time skip also kind of goes down the shithole. And then I hear they hired a shitload of amazing animators and directors for Wano to go all out. But I think that Naruto as an anime is perfectly fine. Naruto, I like the Naruto Akatsuki. Oh, the puppet guy. Sasori arc was one of the few times where Sakura was pretty useful, huh? It was. Sakura, Granny Chio. Sakura was good that arc, man. She was. She was genuinely useful. No, that arc was pretty good. それがもうめちゃくちゃかっこよくて好きになりました。今見てるアニメは鬼滅の刃見てました。まあなんか流行ってたから友達に勧められてみたんですけど、結構面白かったです。で、今までで一番好きなアニメ教えてください。東京グル
アングラな感じだから万人受けしない感じが好きでした今見てるアニメはありますかアタックオンタイタンですねその友達がめっちゃ見ててでなんかもう高校時代からすごいその、うん、結構反響があったんだけど、まあ、全然見たことなくてやっとそう、うん、妹がいてその妹が見ててでまあ自分もじゃあちょっと見てみようかみたいなまあ一言で言うともうアメージングなんだろうちゃんとその伏線回収もしっかり Did they, did, did they do that? They've done a great job tying up loose ends with the story In terms of all the secrets, they're up to the point that I read, yeah. But like, when I when I hear loose ends, I'm thinking about the ending, and ending is the biggest criticism of Attack on Titan, right? They're still in the top. Ah, people's feelings, or their psychology, or more, just like, so, they're writing or something. So, before, I was thinking about the main character's feelings, but I'm thinking about the main character's feelings. Exactly. That's the beauty of it's like you think you're the good people, but then after you cross the fucking ocean, you realize that. Those people are just like you, except they've been propagandized. There is no good or evil, right? And that is the beautiful storytelling of Attack on Titan, where you're in the perspective of this oppressed group thinking you're, everything you're doing is for justice. And then suddenly, you enact that justice and you realize that, are we so different from the bad guys? Yes. And that's the thing, right? There is no right in war. War is just trash for every side. That, that's the thing about war. There's no good or bad side. Everyone fucking loses. And the winners rewrite history in their own perspective and what justice is. Yes.、Yeah, Attack on Titan Season 1, maybe it seemed like that, right? Because simple anime where times of human fight each other, right? That's what people think it is. And that's why it gets a lot of flack. And a lot of people think that there's no good writing because it's just Unga Boonga Slayer. Nope, could not be so more wrong, bro. This shit is good writing. そうだね、全然シンプルじゃなかったね。そう最初はそうもう巨人ぶっ倒せみたいな感じだったけど、もう見始めたらはもう泣くし、もうなんかもういろんな感情がもう一気にあったりして。今見てるアニメは。ナナ、ぐちゃぐちゃした恋愛模様がリアルで好きですね。ナナ is the anime that came out in early 2000s, right? Didn't we just watch a,、uh, the Trash Taste podcast highlights where they're talking about animes from 2001 to 2005? Nana was there, right? Angel Beats. Angel Beats. Look at the reaction. Look at the reaction from her friend. She has an audible gasp, and Takashi is also like, What the fuck? Takashi is like, Oh, she. <laughs> Angel beats. A lot of people. And if you look at the engagement bar here, the highest point of the video is this part. Now, is it because she says Angel beats, or is it because these are two cute girls? I'm not sure. I like it. Yeah. Yeah, okay. I will never watch, I will never watch、uh, Angel Beats. Wait, that's the engagement part? Yes. <laughs> you you, this, are you just figuring this out for the first time? I'm about to blow your mind. Look at the subtitles. Did you know that you can move the subtitles? You, you can move the subtitles. Did you know? You can drag it across. I actually didn't know that until recently. But yes, this, this bar that you see, if it gets high, this is the most replayed section, right? It says it. Most replayed, bro. I guess if you're mobile watchers, you never really pay attention to the bar here. All time best. Inbox Secret Service. Inbox Secret Service. Is this a based rare take? I feel like it is, because I've never seen or heard of this anime. Is this amazing? <laughs> えー、本当にいっぱいあるけど、うん、やっぱ七、七が一番好きかもしれないですね。背景にしときます。うん、more high Q representation here, man. So many people love high Q in Japan. キャラが本当に個性的で、絶対推しが見つかります。今見てるアニメはありますか？ワンピースです。です大好きです。今 TikTok で、うん、あの公式のチャンネルで永遠にやって,やって,て、エースとサボとルフィが子供の頃の話がめっちゃ好きなんですけど、服をもう一回見てやっぱ好きだなーってなりましたね。今アニメを TikTok で見る時代なんですね。ワンピースはなんか昔のやつを配信してたので、たまたま流して見てたんですけど。They're just fucking rebroadcasting One Piece on TikTok? Interesting. I mean, I basically do that shit with, with other anime where it's just like clips though. Wait, they just skipped her. They just, they just skipped this girl. <laughs> She didn't say anything. It's just, I love One Piece. TikTok, One Piece, that's it. All right, we're cutting it off here. It's already been 15 minutes of reactions. If this does well enough, I'll continue watching the rest of these videos. We'll probably make like a four part series. See you in the next one.